Well, one local restaurant is making sure that those letters kids are writing right now to Santa make it up to the North Pole and that they each get a response from the jolly old elf himself. It's serving as a drop off spot for letters to St. Nick. Eyewitness News reporter Jeremy Baker has the story. Gino's Deli is known for steak, sandwiches, and now for Santa. Well, I didn't get from my wife. I bought this little red uh, post office box from Sam's. I was like, take it to the store and let the kids who come in write their letters to Santa. Back to the deli and it just took off. Since November 25th, about 160 kids have been coming to Geno's to make sure old Saint Nick knows what they want for Christmas. It makes me really happy. And when I watch the kids getting excited, dropping the letter, and I saw parents having that smile, you know, because they did that at one time and now their kids are doing it. This is the letter writing station here at Gino's. Kids can pick crayons or even colored pens, whatever they want to use to write their letters to Santa. As a big kid, I wrote one myself asking for snow. Letters from actual kids ask for the usual gift cards, nom noms, and who wouldn't want a panda onesie? But for the owner, Alim, one altruistic letter really stood out. He said that Santa, I don't need any gifts. My parents give me all the gifts. Take my gift somewhere else to somebody else who is in need. That was really sweet. Those at Geno's make sure every child gets a response directly from the North Pole. Because I think he has so many letters to write. So he needs a little bit of help. Since the Santa Express mailbox has been so successful. My wife came up with another idea. Why don't you leave the box out all year long? That little mailbox is going to be a nice friendly reminder to stay on the nice list instead of being on the naughty list. So there you go. If that's the case, they're going to need many more stamps. Jeremy Baker, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.